As shown in the diagram below, the radius of a cone is 2.5 centimeters and its slant height is 6.5 centimeters. How many cubic centimeters are in the volume of the cone? So in order for us to determine the volume of a cone, we need to know the area of the base and we need to know the altitude. And the altitude is the height drawn from the vertex down to the base um, where the line is perpendicular to the base. So in order for us to do this, we're going to have to find out what this length is. So it just so happens that the line is already drawn for us, and, it, and it's indicating that that line is perpendicular to the base, and it's a right triangle. So I can say h squared plus 2.5 squared is equal to 6.5 squared. So I can say h squared is equal to 6.5 squared minus 2.5 squared, or h is equal to the square root of 6.5 squared minus 2.5 squared. So let's find out what that is. Let's punch that into the calculator. So square root of 6.5 squared minus 2.5 squared, that will be 6. So h is equal to 6. So now that I know the altitude, I want to find out what the volume is. So one third. The area of the base is going to be a circle, area of a circle. So that's just pi times 2.5 squared times 6. So looking at this, I know the 3 and the 6 cancels. So I'm left with 2 pi times 2.5 squared. So let's punch that into the calculator. 2 pi 2.5 squared. And that will give me 39.27. So, or actually, all the answers are in terms of pi. So let me do that again. So 2.5 squared times 2 is 12.5. So my final answer is 12.5 pi. And which answer choice is that? That would be option one.